Aluminium is the third most common element on, on our planet after oxygen and silicon, making up over 8% of the Earth's crust. The material is extremely versatile and is being increasingly used for a variety of applications in the construction industry. The Manufacturing Basics of Aluminium Manufacturing Process 1. Bauxite Mine Bauxite is used as the main raw material in the manufacture of aluminium. The bauxite is often mined from only a few meters below the ground level. About 4 to 5 tons of bauxites are required for 1 ton of aluminium. To extract pure alumina, the bare process is used. Two, bauxite grinding. The bauxite mineral is transported to refineries where the clay is washed off and the bauxite passes through a grinder to produce a more consistent material. Three, bauxite crushing and digesting producing sodium alumate. The ground mineral is pumped into large pressure tanks with a caustic soda or sodium hydroxide solution and a steam heat is applied. The caustic soda reacts with the aluminium compounds in the bauxite material to produce a solution of sodium aluminate, also known as slurry. The unwanted residues, also known as red mud, containing iron, silicon and titanium gradually sink to the bottom of the tank and are removed. 4. Settling The sodium aluminate solution is then passed through into lower pressure settling tank. The solution at the top of the tanks is directed downwards through a series of filers to remove excess red mud. The remaining alumina is then passed through huge leaves or cloth filters to remove any solids in the solution. 5. Precipitation. The sodium aluminate solution is then cooled and pumped into large precipitators, sometimes as tall as a six-story building. Aluminium hydroxide seed crystals added to the solution to start the precipitation process. At this point, large aluminium crystals are formed. 6. Calcination. The crystals are then heated in rotary kilns to temperatures over 960 degrees Celsius. This extracts the last impurities and creates a white powder known as alumina or aluminium oxide. The refined alumina is transformed into aluminium through the smelting or Hall Herald process. Seven, smelting process. The alumina is poured into a reduction cell with 950 degrees Celsius molten cryolite. 400 chi electrical currents are passed through the mixture to break the bond between the aluminium and oxygen. The result is 99.8% pure aluminium.
Recycling. Recycling scrap aluminium requires only 5% of the energy used to make new alumin. Aluminium can be recycled over and over again without it losing any of its natural qualities. Recycled aluminium is sorted, cleansed, and remelted to form molten alumin. The molten aluminum is then formed into ingots for rolling, casting, or extruding. Foundry alloys. This can be achieved through cold chamber catting. The metal is heated up in a furnace and then fed into the die with a hydraulic piston. The die will then shape the aluminium to its required form. This is a process used for many applications, such as in the aerospace and electronics industries. <laughs> 